The two-envelope problem is a famous paradox about probabilities. Imagine you have two envelopes and each of them has some money inside. You don't know the exact amount of money in each envelope. The only information you have is that the one envelope contains twice as much money as the other. You're allowed to pick one envelope and keep the money for yourself. Before you open the envelope to check the money, you will be given another chance to switch your envelope to another one. The question is, should you stick to your current selection or switch to another envelope? Most people may have the following calculation. Let's assume that you randomly pick up an envelope called A, and the amount of money in it is X. So, the amount of money in another envelope is either double or half of X. Since the chance for each case is 50 to 50. So, if you choose to switch to another envelope, the expected amount you will get is 5X slash 4. Since that amount is bigger than X, from the probability perspective, you should swap the envelope. Now, we have the paradox. If you are given another chance to swap envelopes again, you will have the same reason to switch back. Then, you will swap it the third time, and so on. You will end up in an infinite loop of swapping. What's wrong with this calculation? The key to demystify this paradox is to understand the real meaning of X. The first X in the equation indicates that the amount X in envelope A is less than envelope B. However, the second X in the equation indicates that the amount X in envelope A is greater than B. So, the flaw in our reasoning is that the same symbol X is used with two different meanings in different situations. However, they have been used together in one equation and are assumed to have the same value. The modified equation should be like this. If A is larger than B, the expected value in B will be X. If A is less than B, the expected value in B will be 2X. So, the final result for this modified equation will be 1 half X plus 2X equals 3X slash 2. Due to the fact that the sum of two envelopes is X plus 2X equals 3X. So, the expected value for the current envelope is also 3X slash 2. So there is no incentive to switch envelopes and hence no paradox. Thanks for watching. If you like the video, please hit the like button or subscribe button for more interesting topics.